Hiya, uh, this is my big birthday haul because um, recently it was my birthday um, so I just wanted to show you some things that I've got um, some things that I've been buying around my birthday just with birthday money um, and I started doing two parts just because the first part can be my clothes and accessories and the second part is more beauty products and things like that so I thought it should be a bit more interesting and a bit less in a big chunk if I did it in two parts um, so I thought I'd just start off with what I'm wearing basically. Um, this is like a Topshop sort of new t-shirt style that they're doing and I love these. Um, they're only £14 which I think is really good for Topshop and obviously the quality is pretty good. Um, and I don't know if you can see but it's like speckled sort of material. Um, and they do it in three, well more than three colours. This sort of grey white colour, a pink, a, grey, um, a green, I'm not sure what else they do. Um, so I also bought it in pink just because I couldn't leave them behind. But if you can see, it's sort of got a um, tiered bottom, which is really nice because it means that um, like you can wear it with leggings and things like that. And I really like the sleeves, I think they're quite flattering, because um, also I don't really like my arms very much. So because the arms are quite baggy, it makes your arms look a bit smaller. So yeah, they're a really nice addition to my wardrobe because I think you can wear them with leggings and also shorts and things like that in summer so with a student discount I think that's pretty good um, and then my necklace is from Primark just a nice collar necklace four pounds it's a shame they don't do it in a gold but they do do one similar um, but I love this necklace I've been wearing it ever since I've got it um, so on that theme of necklaces I'll show you this I've got this collar necklace from H&M it's kind of like rose gold copper colour and it just sort of fits around here. I haven't really worn it much yet because I haven't really worked out how's best to wear it. So, but I thought it was really cute. Can't remember how much that was. I think it was about seven pounds. So again, not too pricey. Um, and this, I really liked this. I saw it in, or I think it was Wallace, but it was in the sale. And it's just another like collar necklace, but it's just a bit more interesting. And it's gold, and it's like these things move around. Um, and that was in the sale, and I think it ended up being about £4, so I think that was pretty good for the fact... I think it was originally £12, so I got quite a bargain there. So I'm loving necklaces at the moment. Um, just some other little bits and bobs. Um, my sister, for my birthday, got me these really cute scarves. I'm not really sure where they were from. I think they're vintage or second-hand. Um, but I think they're just really cute to wear with any sort of outfit. So she got me three, and they're all in like different colours. Um, this one's probably my favourite because it's sort of the colours that are um, in at the moment. And obviously I can just wear it how I like, whatever really. Um, if I had short hair I might have been able to do something with it up there but who knows. Um, then running along the theme of presents, um, my boyfriend got me these which are one of my favourite things at the moment. Pug pyjamas. don't know if you can see that but how cute is that dog? and got like quite nice sleeves I love baggy pyjamas and he knows me well so he got me quite a big size so that's really cool and then it comes with these really cute dog print shorts and again it was better for me to have a bigger size because I got a big bum so yeah they are so cute and I love them and um, just make me laugh every time I wear them um, running along the theme of Topshop because they were from Topshop um, I think they were quite expensive pyjamas but it was my birthday so um, I bought this eventually, it's the um, short grey jersey dress, again it's that speckled material but I love this, it's so simple but it looks so nice, like with this collar necklace as well, I just love it, um, I did want to get the petite version but um, I, think I couldn't find the petite version but I got 20% off because there was like a Debenhams 20% off the other day and they had a Topshop sort of bit in there so I ended up getting about £5 off which I thought was really good so it ended up being about 20 quid, which for Topshop dress is pretty nice I think it's been really nice in summer or um, just with leggings or tights or no legs leggings, not low legs um, so and then I will move on to Primark now this is kind of the dupe version of that dress and this was in the Primark sale, which I always find ridiculous because Primark things are always so like cheap anyway. But this is so similar to the Topshop one. I don't know how well you can see all this, but um, I'll just go like that. 
so it's just the same sort of length as the Topshop one. It's not the speckled material, but again, it's actually not bad material. It's quite thick, really. It was originally £8, then it says £5 on there. Then when I got up to the till, it was £3, so that's even better. Kind of feels just a bit harsh that you have to, like, pay so little. It's a bit ridiculous. But I thought it'd be nice with a bell, again, with a collar necklace, that sort of thing. I'm doing some work experience soon, so that sort of thing would be quite good for that. Um, carrying on with Primark. These are so cute at the moment. They're the six pounds dresses. A lot of people are wearing them. This is the pink version. Quite short though, this is the problem I have with these dresses. And they have a gap at the back, which is all well and good, but bra issues and things like that. But I thought they were like, couldn't pass really. They're great for summer, great for the beach. And um, even with leggings, they're really nice. Nice, cute pattern. I had to buy the white one as well, just cause I love white dresses. So got really nice embroidered material, but they are so short. Luckily I'm short, but I still don't think I'd feel that comfortable wearing them without anything, unless I was just on the beach sort of thing. Um, moving on to H&M. Now H&M have some really great things at the moment. Um, I went to Lakeside and I wasn't that happy with the Lakeside in general, um, but when I went to Worcester for a weekend, um, I ended up finding some lovely things in their H&M, even though it was quite a strange H&M. So um, I'll just start off with this dress. Um, it's like, oh, it does do up there. Um, I think this was £20, which at the time I thought was quite expensive, but the material's pretty good and it's got a um, underline, underline, lining underneath. Um, so yeah, it's got a cute collar and I love my collars. So there, and then no sleeves quite sheer but again it's got the lining and then it goes up and it's quite short okay but I just think that's really nice I could wear that in the day which I did when I went up to London um, or a night thing with tights or no tights I just think it's really versatile and it's a real shame that they don't have it in other, any other colours because I just think it's really cute like the pockets like a, quite an added touch and I like where it goes in here so that's really nice so it's a shame I don't do it in different colours, H&M. And um, this, you might have seen it around because I think quite a lot of people are going to start wearing this. Um, but this was £15, but I think it was worth it just because it's so cute. It's like a really lovely pale pink coral um, top with a collar. Nice embroidery at the top there. And then it's just, it's really creased, really sorry, because <laughs> I've worn this. Um, and again it's got quite a long bottom compared to the front this is so cute um, I think you could wear a collar necklace with this and um, wear it with shorts or leggings um, it's quite versatile, could be smart, cash but um, I just think it's such a cute colour for summer um, I think it's really pretty so yeah there's that one I think that's totally worth it okay so next from H&M we have this quite plain white top but at the moment I'm sort of loving baggy white tops um, it's not extremely long but um, this one's still got a label in £7.99 which I think is pretty good for a plain white top got quite big sleeves um, the more I look at it the more I think oh do I like that but I do think I do like it um, it kind of has funny bits around the boob area but um, I think they're just to add a bit of shape but I think it's just quite again quite nice you could wear it with shorts or with leggings or however you feel it's just quite an unusual shape but this came in different colours as well and different patterns so that's quite cool um, next also from H&M this was um, sort of on special offer I think I don't think it's normally but it was only £10 um, I quite like polka dots so I got this cute this is really creased as well it's obviously a material they use but kind of like a play suit at first it's got a v-neck which I'm not entirely happy about because I don't really like v-necks but um, it's got a ruched bit there which you can tie and it's just quite short again but I think that's really cute for summer and it's got ties on the arms or however you want to say it um, so you can make it shorter or longer um, and I think it's another flattering shape and again good for summer and holidays and things like that so I thought this was another good purchase This, oh yeah £10 this was so again H&M doing very well um, then I went to London and um, I cannot pass up an opportunity to go to Forever 21 when I'm in London and I'm so happy that they are bringing a Forever 21 to 
my local big store which is Blue Water um, and I cannot wait for that although I'll end up spending quite a lot I think but I think it's just such reasonable prices for what the clothes are um, so me and my two friends we were like trying on quite a few things and I was like oh I hope I don't like all this because I couldn't afford to get all of it um, so I got this which is again my usual kind of style um, with the collar and the no sleeves but I really thought it was quite an unusual colour and I love that little detail on like the breast area and then it's just quite see through and then again I think like the back is longer than the front so sort of hiding your modesty a bit or creating modesty whatever um, but I just think this is really cute you can you can wear a top underneath if you want um, which is a bit annoying but it is see through because sometimes I don't like having to wear a top underneath but I also don't like my bra show so you can wear it with leggings, um, I wore it with um, leggings and you can wear it with shorts which I'm planning to do. Again this is quite versatile because you can wear it like evening and in the day. This was probably on the more expensive side I would like, I think it was £18 but I just think it's quite a timeless piece and I think it's just really cute and it fits really well. Now I've been wanting some nice denim shorts for a long time because I have been wearing my um, DIY shorts which I use, I cut off my dad's old jeans um, and they're really cute but they're all, they also don't fit properly because they're not obviously my proper size so um, I've been wanting to get some decent denim cut off shorts for a long time but I'm not happy with my legs or my bum really and I've got quite, like I'm a pear shape so I have to get quite big sizes in the bottoms and sometimes I feel like I don't really want to go that big but I don't think size really matters much anymore um, so I went into Forever 21 and I saw these Lush shorts and also length is a big problem. I went into River Island and they were like that short. I was like, oh, they're disgusting. If they had like a couple more inches on them, they'd be so much nicer. So I bought these little beauties um, and they're quite short, but not as short as some others I'd found. They've got cute frayed edges. Um, so I think that's really nice. And what is also really great about these, they were only 13, not 75, such a random number, but 1375 for a decent pair of like denim shorts. Obviously it's probably not real denim, but oh I just think that is amazing. So thank you, thank you, Forever 21. Um so yeah, I really love those. So that is it. Um I thought I had more than that, although I probably have been rambling for quite a long time. Um, I hope you enjoyed the first part of my birthday haul with all my clothes um, and stay part, stay part, stay in tune for um, part two which is all my beauty products and things like that that I've been getting recently for my birthday. So yeah, thanks for watching, bye!